That's what's so great about an active adult community. If you're just not sitting in your house and you don't know your neighbor, you'll know your neighbor here. We found Highgate because we lived in an active adult community on the east side. And we really wanted to come to the west side to live here. And we went over to Brighton Park, which is another Castle and Cook community. And they were actually sold out. So we talked to the sales lady there, Sharon Snap, and she let us know that there could possibly be an active adult community in Highgate. So we pursued that avenue of waiting for something to come here in Highgate. Oh, well, we love the community. I mean, it was beautiful. I mean, we entered these big, beautiful gates and the landscaping. It looks like it's been here for you know, a year. Uh, when we came and looked at the models, um, they were spacious, they were airy, but they didn't have real large lots. And when you're retired, you don't want to be having to take care of a backyard. You just want a patio environment. So that's what it had. All the frames you can make so easily in this type of environment. We've already made friends with four different couples that I think will be friends forever. And the lodge, once it's completed here, will be a, a nucleus for people getting together and, and meeting each other and making more friends. And uh, gated, gated, big, security. Um, it's just, just a great lifestyle. Well, actually, we were looking to downsize, and we did. We did 100 square feet, but um, we like the open floor plan. It's got tons of storage. We actually, this is the first home we've had with some empty cupboards, and it's just a, it's conducive to entertaining, this floor plan. We like um, the idea that, that you can just um, come in and, and gather in one area, um, it's just, it's, well, uh, this room is just big. And so we needed something, we preferred something on a corner so that we have room to pull the RV in and uh, unload it and unload it. And that's another plus. When we leave and travel, we're very secure that our house is going to be watched over by neighbors. And that's a good feeling when you leave town. They can watch and make sure you don't break a sprinkler that you're, everything's okay with your house. So that's, that was a big plus also in this type of community. For me, uh, it's, uh, I, it, it's a secure feeling. It's a secure feeling that you're living in a community that's safe. You're living in a community with people with the same interests. You're living in a community that they've come here because they, they want the same thing out of their life, um, in the latter part of their life. And it's some place that you feel comfortable that should you lose a spouse or should you know something happen, you've got people around you that are either in the same, you know, the same predicament, or they've been through it, or will be there for you, other than your family. And I, I think that's for me, it's it's a secure feeling. Friendship, friendship, friendships. That's you've already uh, established some good friendships, and there's going to be many more of them. And that's what this type of community. Harvest to you. People drive around and wave, and it's, uh, it's, I don't know what it is. It's just that type of environment. Active adult communities do that.